Did you know that eating this with eggs could destroy brain cells and lead to dementia? Eggs are considered a superfood, truly beneficial for your health. However, what you eat them with and how you cook them are crucial. Unknowingly, the habit of eating eggs with certain foods could even lead to cancer and dementia. And also share three miraculous foods that not only prevent dementia but also brighten your eyes. Hello everyone. Are there any of you who haven't subscribed yet? Please press subscribe and like right now. And don't forget to share the video with your dear friends and family. I'll continue to provide only the best health information. Recently, the number of people suffering from dementia has significantly increased. Not only among the middle-aged and elderly, but also dementia in the young population of people in their 20s and 30s is becoming a serious issue. The primary cause of dementia is, indeed, dietary habits. Every food has its best matches. That can enhance the absorption of nutrients and bad combinations that can harm our bodies. Knowing this and applying it to our dietary habits is the best choice for our health. Today's star is the superfood, eggs, known for their high-quality protein. Various minerals, vitamins, and numerous nutrients. But did you know, depending on what you eat with eggs, it can harm your health and even lead to cancer and dementia? That's why I've prepared this. In today's video, we will reveal three foods. You should absolutely avoid eating with eggs to prevent cancer and dementia. And also share three best ways to eat eggs that not only prevent cancer and dementia but also brighten your eyes. Firstly, the food you should absolutely never eat with eggs is flour and bread. You may consume a lot of egg bread and flour. And eggs are indeed essential ingredients for making bread. However, this combination is really bad for preventing cancer and dementia. Eggs contain a component called choline, which is a type of vitamin B group. This is why eggs are called brain food. Choline is beneficial for memory and concentration enhancement. And, as a vitamin B complex, constitutes up to 30% of brain cell components. Activating brain functions to improve memory and concentration. And is used in the prevention and treatment of forgetfulness, dementia, Alzheimer's, etc. It's even highly effective in reducing inflammation in the body, thus preventing cancer. However, there's something that works in direct opposition to the action of choline. That's right, flour. When you eat bread, which is primarily made of carbohydrates, your blood sugar rises and creates a lot of sugar toxins. These sugar toxins attack brain cells. If you eat bread and eggs together, it's like a war in your body. The choline in the eggs tries to create a protective barrier for the brain cells. While the sugar toxins from the bread try to penetrate this barrier to attack the brain cells. Moreover, if you frequently consume flour-based foods like noodles, bread, egg tart, spaghetti, and white rice, and are already in a state of high blood sugar, the problem becomes more serious. With high insulin resistance and chronic inflammation already filling your body, choline's efforts to protect us become futile. This internal battle can lead to cardiovascular diseases like hypertension and arteriosclerosis. Issues with insulin secretion leading to diabetes and chronic inflammation can cause cancer, dementia, and brain diseases. Therefore, it's better to opt for whole wheat bread or healthy vegan breads that are not made with refined flour to eat with eggs. The first best companion for eggs is none other than the pumpkin. Eggs and pumpkins make a really great pairing. Especially since the protein in eggs helps with absorption in our body. Moreover, when you consume the fiber from pumpkins along with the calcium in eggs, it activates the parasympathetic nervous system, bringing a sense of calm 
and easing anxiety and tension. It also reduces physical tension, bringing stability to both our body and mind. It's often said that stress is the root of all illnesses. Eating eggs with pumpkin helps relieve stress and fatigue in the body. Additionally, consuming pumpkin, which converts to vitamin A in the body, is especially good for eye health. Working together with the abundant lutein and zeaxanthin carotenoids found in eggs, it provides powerful antioxidant action that not only protects the retina, but can also significantly reduce the incidence of degenerative eye diseases like glaucoma and macular degeneration. If your eyes have been feeling blurry or your vision cloudy, try eating eggs with pumpkin. Recommended recipes include pumpkin pancakes or tarts, pumpkin egg rolls, and pumpkin egg soup. Secondly, the foods you should absolutely never eat with eggs are soy milk and tofu. Some people eat soy milk and eggs together as a breakfast substitute. And many consume them for weight loss and diet purposes. Also, there are those who boil warm soy soup and break a raw egg into it to eat together. However, eggs and soy milk should not be mixed. This is due to the trypsin inhibitor found in soy milk. Trypsin, a component in soybeans, the raw material of soy milk, combines with avidin in egg whites, destroying the nutrients. Eggs are rich in high-quality protein, which not only helps prevent muscle loss and sarcopenia in the elderly, making muscles stronger, but also contain abundant vitamins and minerals. When consumed with soy milk, these beneficial nutrients cannot be absorbed. So they should not be eaten together. If your throat feels blocked when eating eggs, it's much better to have them with milk or water. And there's one more thing to remember. Have you ever had tea, like green tea or black tea, with eggs? That's a big no. Drinking tea after eating eggs, because your throat feels dry and clogged, causes the tannins in the tea leaves to combine with the eggs' proteins, forming tannin protein complexes. This slows down intestinal peristalsis worsens the intestinal environment, and leads to constipation. The most frightening aspect is that it increases the body's absorption potential for toxic substances and carcinogens. Therefore, tea and soy milk should absolutely not be consumed with eggs. It's best to have them with water or milk. Then, the second best companion for eggs is none other than cheese. Cheese not only tastes great but also is nutritionally the best match with eggs. Eggs are called a complete food because they contain many nutrients. But relative to dairy products, they are very low in calcium. Dairy products are rich in calcium. So when consumed with eggs, they can complement each other. Especially since cheese is made by fermenting milk. The fermentation process with probiotics reduces the protein content, allowing you to complement each other's nutrition without excessively consuming protein. Lastly, the third worst companion for eggs is apricot. You might not often eat apricot with eggs, but it's really important to remember because it can be dangerous. Apricot and dried apricots are often consumed as a dessert. Eating apricots after eggs can cause mild symptoms like headaches, diarrhea, vomiting, and signs of food poisoning. In severe cases, it can lead to acute gastroenteritis and even bezoars. The reason is due to tannin, the component that gives apricots their astringent taste, which impairs the digestive function of proteins. Tannin, a type of phenolic compound, clumps together with proteins in the mouth, stomach, and digestive system. It also inhibits the action of protein-degrading enzymes in the body, making it really dangerous to consume with eggs. The third best companion for eggs is none other than apples. Eggs contain a variety of nutrients but are lacking in vitamin C and dietary fiber. Apples are very rich in both vitamin C and dietary fiber. 
especially, dietary fiber helps with bowel movement by aiding the intestinal movement and also helps expel bad cholesterol from the body, preventing cardiovascular diseases such as arteriosclerosis, heart disease, and stroke. Particularly, it aids in the digestion of proteins. Some people feel like their stomach is clogged and have difficulty digesting after eating eggs. In such cases, accompanying them with an apple can stimulate the secretion of gastric juices, aiding in digestion and absorption. Lastly, the way eggs are cooked is also very important. When consuming eggs, it's crucial to prepare them in a way that preserves as many nutrients as possible without destroying them. Firstly, eating raw eggs is not recommended due to the risk of food poisoning. Also, frying eggs is not advisable. Both steaming and boiling are good methods, but it's better to consume eggs that are soft-boiled rather than hard-boiled to the point of being rubbery. Furthermore, when making fried eggs, it's recommended to use oils with a high content of omega-3, such as olive oil or flaxseed oil. We've explored the three worst and best foods to eat with eggs for cancer and dementia prevention. Then, it's time to summarize. Rather than eat eggs with flour like bread, choose pumpkin to consume the best benefits out of it. Do not eat eggs with soy products like soy milk or tofu, choose cheese with eggs. And, never eat eggs with apricot, but eat with apples. Thank you so much for your time. I hope you remember and take good care of your health with this information. If you found today's video helpful, please don't forget to subscribe and like. Also, share the video with your dear family and friends. I will always pray for your health and happiness. I will continue to greet you with more useful and informative health information. Thank you.